So today、uh, we'll be talking about design. How do you go about designing these things? For those who are not architects or planners or designers, how would you、uh, approach this? The alpha principles of Earth architecture that we carry on is、uh, arches, vaults, domes, earth, water, air, and fire. I believe with these seven notes, you can really create almost anything. Those are almost unchanged anywhere you go in the universe, and we come up now with all these new design. Parameters that are based on those elements. Not that、uh, we are asking everybody to start building walls and domes. This isn't about that at all. It is to show you the structures that could be reasonably built today, that could withstand、uh, hurricanes and flood and even earthquakes. We are taking the best of the past and moving it into the future. So this unit then will stand by itself. It doesn't need a column. It doesn't need a beam. You don't need to cut trees. And yet, for us to build a small house, we have to go and cut the forest, create all these factories, bring cement, bring steel, bring plastic, all of that, just to build ourselves a small house. Definitely. It's like a martial art that you need to know the movement, the meaning of them. You're creating what we call shell structures. Take that egg in a long way and put it in the palm of your hand and try to break it. Whoever breaks that egg, we give them a hundred dollars. We are still waiting for an egg to be broken, and of course, they immediately the kids they say, "Oh, it's nothing." And they go, oh, and then two people press, three people press. It doesn't work. That egg is a shell structure. No matter who says what we can do, there is never enough material manufactured in this world to go and build everything for everybody. It's just impossible. They have to use the earth.